This is a quick tutorial to share how to turn off the focused inbox or turn it on if that's what you wish to do. So currently I am in my Outlook um, mailbox online and I have a focused mailbox and an other box. And so if this is turned on and you're, you're looking for email and you, you can't find it, there's a chance that it could be in this other tab. So right now um, in Microsoft, there is AI, artificial intelligence, pulling the emails they think you need to see most and under other, the email that they think you don't need to see right away. And so, for example, I have my Schoology notifications in here, but also something that was really important. I was waiting for this share. Um, inside of this uh, other box. And so it's up to you and I would caution you on whether you want to keep all of your mail together or if you want to take that responsibility of going through focused and other because of course all of our email is going to be important um, and if you can't find it that could prove to be a problem. So if you want to turn off the focused inbox and maybe it's already turned on for you, you're going to go over to the gear and you're going to select it and you're going to go down to the display settings. When you're in the display settings, you'll see that you have uh, several choices here across the top. One of them is for a focused inbox. And so if you do not want to have a focused and other box, you're going to go ahead and click don't sort messages and then click OK. And then you'll notice that your inbox is now just one mailbox. Let me click OK one more time is now just one box. So this is, again, completely up to you. I'm going to go back to my display settings and I'll try focused inbox. So if you want to take the time to look at, at uh, focused and other or just choose that one, it is going to be a personal preference, but we're going to say that we're recommending in the instructional technology department that you turn it off so that you get all of your emails in one place. Again, a personal preference and completely up to you, but you can turn it on or turn it off. And that's how you'll do it by going to the settings, display settings and making that change there.